<laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play The Long Dark. My name is Weasel, and we just used a stim pack. We are super exhausted, meaning we're taking stim uh, uh, condition hits now. I tried to get up as fast as I could uh, to Timberwolf Mountain. We have four days and 38 minutes left. Now we have to get to the summit of Timberwolf Mountain. I'm super exhausted, so I will need sleep. Uh, six hours of daylight left. <sighs> it's gonna get so close. It's gonna get really, really close. I'm considering just sleeping a few hours and then... I mean, I might sleep, have to sleep through the night. It's just gonna bring me down another 12 hours or so. Or even more than that. And then make it to the summit. Which is the highest point of the mountain. I had to look up actually summit just to make sure it doesn't mean anything else. Summit is indeed the highest point of the map. Here's our first part of the crash plane on Timberwolf Mountain. The wheel. From which I'm, I'm going to go right to go to the hut that's on the, uh, that's over there next to the lake, which is going to also uh, be a what do you call it landmark for me to orient myself on. I would really like it if it wasn't that foggy. It's been clearing up a bit, quite a bit. Yes, landing gear, all that is left of it. Um, I think the hut should be. In this direction. I can't run right now because I'm fully out of stamina. I'm actually exhausted, hungry, somewhat thirsty, dry mouthed, but alive. I didn't fall down the rope. I was that was quite scary, wasn't it? You know, if for all you know, that could have been the last episode of this run. But no, we made it. Barely. Barely. Okay, so wait a second. I'm a little bit lost. It it should come up somewhere here. I see parts of the plane. That I don't remember. Wait. Is this it? I'm trying to make out where I am. Hmm. Yeah, I've only been here once for a few episodes. This is yeah, this is the place. Can I see the lake? Yes, you're hungry, don't worry. I'm not going to use another emergency stem. Even though it is very tempting. Wait, oh, okay. Here's the lake. It's a little uh, bigger than I remembered it to be. But that means the hut is going to be on the left or on the right. Somewhere. Might have walked around it. In a weird manner. Yeah, we should be there shortly. Ah, yes, here we are at... Crystal Lake. I, yes, Crystal Lake, that's what it's called. Here's our hut, yes. I was correct. I was pointing in the right direction, just walked a little off. So, the mountain is here. You can't see it right now. The top of the mountain is in this direction. Right now, it's too foggy to see, which is, in general, a bad thing. Find the stress pistol. I hope that these four days are not for having to run back to Desolation Point, because I'm a little bit worried about that. Should be easier to find my way back than find it in the first place, but I will be fine. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a challenge if I had too much time on my hands. Okay, let's hope that there's some good stuff here, but first of all, sleep. Or one of those things. This time, I'm not going to forget about the hatch on the floor. Come on. Yeah. There's a Climber Journal's page showing me probably some interesting things. Rope, arc, stoneheart, wing. Yeah, I'm gonna need the rope. Item found. Can I have a look in this uh, journal? Stance. Uh, can I look at it? Examine. I forgot. Arrived at the base. Going. Yeah, I remember. If you guys want to read this, pause it now. And. Yeah. He heard the plane crash. Storm lantern not needed since I have one. Flare, pinnacle peaches. Rifle clean kit, sewing kit. Why did I pick up that sewing kit? That rope. Super heavy, Ooh, super important. Heavy. Not to worry. This time, since we are here, uh, since we're gonna go to the summit of the mountain, we can drop some gear. We can put it here and use um, use this as a sh temporary base of operation. It's because there's a few things that I'm not going to need to bring with me. For example, I don't need th five of those. I'm gonna bring one. To make a fire on the way. Uh, and I'm already all, yeah, down a few grams. There's plenty of fire if we want to make some. 
Very nice. I don't. I'm not gonna plan to. Let's see what's. Ooh, mittens. Porks and beans, soda. I will take that. But I can repair those mittens. They're fantastic. Very good. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna do anything with that yet. Down vest. Uh, yeah, that, not 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 impressed at all by it. First aid kit has what for me? An emergency stim. Yay! We can we can run our way. Uh, we can run our way there. Hexaw. Ha. Huh. Interesting. More flares. Hmm. So in kit I can leave behind. Okay. All right. Time to sleep. It is sleepy time. Something else down here that I'm not missing. Nope. Okay. We have four of the airlight left. I'm going to rest for 12. I'm going to rest as much as I can. Then do some reparations. Not reparations. Some repairs. Reparations are completely different things, Weasel. That is what countries do after the war. Or, you know, other reparations, not necessarily only these. Okay, let's get some food in me. Plenty of food for that matter. Uh, yeah, eat, eat the old stuff. Let's get rid of that first. Drink. Yeah, some wolf meat would be nice right now, but yeah, not happening, obviously. If I had the hacksaw, if I have the hacksaw, I mean, I can use that to open some uh, crates uh, repair. Okay, we're gonna use the time, the extra night time we have to repair our gear. Uh, it's gonna be worth it. First of all, we're gonna be warmer. Uh, I can even repair the boots. Uh, we're gonna feel warmer and we're gonna carry around less weight with us. Yes, you're cold, I know. Feels like minus four. Not to worry. And repair this thing as well. It's decent, but yeah, as you can see, just standing around at night is gonna gonna freeze me. So, I'm gonna rest for like four hours. Let's do three. Let's rest for three and see what the temperature is like. Okay, so we slept for three hours. I'm a little st I'm still a little cold. Bummer. Um, hmm, gives me five. You know, I'm gonna rest. Oh, you're not tired. Well, I'm gonna pass two hours of time then. Yeah, warm goes up. Good. Feels like two. Good. Very nice. I'm warm enough during the day now, inside at least. Outside is gonna be a completely different ballpark. Drink some water, eat some food, and off we go. Oh, please, no wind. That's the last thing I need. Okay, so I have a plan how to get to the summit. I have been studying maps for a while. Great, it's a snowstorm. Great, that's... Totally what I need. Feels like minus 18. You can't forget to go outside and uh, during this weather. Might as well rest another hour or so in the hopes that the storm goes away. That's all I can do. It probably won't. You woke up fully rested. Okay. Decisions, decisions. It's really bad. It's a really bad snowstorm. Going out now. Incredibly stupid to go out. <sighs> but you know what? I'll do it. Screw it. We can do it. How much am I carrying? 27. Okay, grab some pinnacle peaches. Grab some peanut butter and the accelerant. And we're leaving. We're off. <laughs> during a snowstorm. I have a rough idea where to go. I'm gonna follow this river. I think it's a river. That's gonna lead us to a waterfall which is in close proximity to a <sighs> climbing rope, I want to say. Let's make sure we're avoiding the wolves. And yeah, feels like minus 13. Oh, did I bring the hacksaw? Please tell me I brought the hacksaw. Of course, I forgot the hacksaw. I'm an idiot. I have to go back because that could be really beneficial. If we come pa uh, by the metal crates, we can open them up. And there's plenty of stuff in there. Lots of clothes, lots of food items. Anything you can basically think of. So what I'll do is I'll go back, grab the hacksaw, rest for another hour to bring my stamina up. Ooh, a hatchet! I Sweet! I scare. Well, possibly. Right now we're just gonna go back and then drop, probably drop the hatchet inside. I'm probably not gonna need one. Or a few other things. Man. The Great Expedition, that, that, that lasted very long, didn't it? Okay, 
Drop the fuel. It's not needed. Drop the knife. Because I got the hatchet. And give me the hacksaw. Thank you. How heavy is that? A kilogram. I need to drop something else for it. Mm. I might need the rope. I might need the rope. Then again, why would I need the rope? I need the rope to get down from somewhere. Hmm. Maybe I'll need it. I'll take it along just in case. Just in case. <sighs> All right. Cool, we have the hacksaw. Oh, the storm's over. Perfect. Good that we came back. Um, yeah, it's. Oh, I'm encumbered still? Let's drink something and the problem is solved. Just like that. Oh, and we're gonna drop all the cloth right over here. We'll 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 find it once we can come back. This just allows me to go a little bit easier. Okay, we got one wolf in our way. This is where I want to go, and I don't have the time for games. So he either leaves me alone, or I'm gonna shoot his head off. Well, looks like he's not gonna leave me alone. Let's hope he doesn't sidestep. Ah. Good job, Weasel. Good job. Torn clothing. Why can't I for why can't I hit them? Why can't I hit them? Uh okay. How are we feeling? Feels like minus eight. Understandable. Torn clothing. What was torn? I think the boots were torn a little bit. Uh well nothing we can do now. One of these days, I'll I'll shoot them properly. I'll I'll learn how to shoot a wolf. Promise. I do not trust the piece. I do not trust the piece. We got a fallen over tree here. Looks very eerie. How am I feeling? A little cold. Slightly winded. Is that a bear? Oh, that's a bear. Great. Great. That's that's like the least thing that I want right now. I really don't want to deal with a bear right now. So. Um Great. I, I hear him growl angrily. Please, please stay away from me, Mr. Bear. Because I do not want to spend all my bullets fighting you. Okay. I might have to use an emergency stim or so. Yep, he, he ha he's, he's, he's smelling me. He's coming for me. I'm not running. If I start running, he might come after me. And I need all my stamina to get up the rope. That is... In the distance, I can see it. Very good. Stay there. I I don't have a picnic basket, Yogi. Do you call him Yogi in the US? Let me know. Yogi the bear. I think he's called Yogi. Only saw it in German, so I'm not entirely sure. <sighs> okay, we're good. I think, I think he's not following anymore. He must have given up or not care anymore. This is now what we have to go up. I am full with stamina. I'm a tad tired. Just a bit. How about I'm just gonna eat something? Some peanut butter. Get some calories in me. Drink something to reduce the weight. It's not gonna be reduced a lot. But at least a little bit. And up we go. Let's hope for the best. I mean, I'm not encumbered anymore. My stamina's full. We should be good. If that is not enough, I'm gonna complain to someone somewhere. You can do it. I have no idea what her name is. I'm gonna call her Jill. Jill, you can do this. Or Brunhilde. Brunhilde is also a beautiful German name. Germans have the best names. Brunhilde. Gerda. Nailed it. Nice, we're up, which means we have a cave, uh, a mine in this direction, I think, and some dropped uh, metal crates, if I remember correctly. Last time I've been here, or maybe not. I, I do not remember right now. I think I see. I, I think I see the cave in the distance. I might as well run at this point. And in the cave, we're gonna be able to warm up because, yeah, I'm cold, cold and alone. Could have sworn there were metal crates somewhere. Maybe a little bit in that direction. That oh, would be great. Faint. Well, please don't. Don't faint. That's that would be very rude and inconsiderate of you. I, I got people watching you. There's 
a lot of viewers that are following you and just fainting right now would be more than inconsiderate. Yep, there is a plane part. I forgot which one. Might be the engine. Where's the cave? There's the cave! I think that's a mine. Mine slash cave. Probably not a mine. Um, looks like there's only engine parts. Nothing for us to forage. And I'm definitely going to be able to sleep in an engine part. Yeah, there's still a lot of mountain to go. In we go. I hope I can... I hope it's warm in there. It should be. At least it should help a little bit. Feels like minus three outside with some uh, wind protection and some fire. We can do this. Okay. Good. Cave. Yes, please. Let's go into the cave. Now, what we got? Cave. Yes, I discovered a cave. Fantastic. I could sleep in here. Feels like five, uh, six hours of daylight left. Mm, I do need sleep. That is indeed a thing I need. That is indeed a thing I need. I need to go through this cave as far as I know, as far as I read. Uh, because this will bring me um, to the other side of the mountain. I, otherwise, I can't get up here. There's apparently several ways to get to the summit. Just not entirely sure. Ugh, creepy. Creepy, eerie. And... Yep. I got some fur firewood. I'll just take that for now. I'm gonna have to find the way out. Okay, this is not the way out. Is it over here somewhere? Please. Ah. <sighs> oh. I could just lay down and have a little sleep right here. More firewood. Where's that uh, firewood coming from? I'm pretty sure there was not a tree in here. Someone must have brought that in. Whoever stayed in here. Um, Cool. This is a cave. I would like to get out of this cave, please. Did I go the wrong way? I'm not sure I can carry much more. Uh, you'll be fine. You'll be fine for now. If you're a little tired, I can, I can handle that. But... I honestly don't know right now where I need to head. Because it seems that this is the only path. I have to go in this direction? I am not sure. Let's just explore together. Um, this will just lead down. And this is where I'm from. So it is safe to assume that this is the wrong place. Oh, I've been walking the wrong way. I walked down again and I... I think I found the path out of here. I hope so. Looks good. I'm somewhere underneath the mountain. I'm somewhere under the summit, I think. Uh, okay, just stay this way. Oh, it splits. Fantastic. Let's go left. When in doubt, go left. What could possibly go wrong? He says as a giant monster bat flies at him and eats off his face. Hopefully not. This is going down quite a bit. I don't know if I agree with going down further. Uh, I guess I'm out of options. Wow. This keeps going down. The cave that keeps on giving. Oh, that guy. Hey. We must be super on the right path if we meet dead people. That's probably a really good sign. To meet all of these dead guys. Where he failed, we will succeed. Maybe. Okay, so we came in for this. And we're gonna keep going here. Eh. Please don't be a dead end. Please don't be a dead end. Nope, there's the exit. I hope that this exit is on the other side of the mountain. Otherwise, I have no way of orienting myself. We're gonna go out. Orientating myself. Uh, we're gonna go out of here in a little bit. We're gonna... Uh, should we sleep? Yeah, definitely. We should sleep for at least a few hours. I don't, oh, leave cave. Great. I didn't I didn't want to leave the cave. But at least that allows me to have a quick look around. Um, oh, yeah. Great. I'm, I'm in somewhat of a canyon. I think this is the right place, though. Okay, go in the cave. We need to warm up first. We're gonna continue this in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this The Long Dark episode, let me know. Leave a comment, leave a like, I'm Weasel, I'm Mod, and hope to see you around. Bye-bye!
Bum 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 b